Gordon to the rescue! It was still the day that Connor and Caitlin had arrived on the island of Sodor. Thomas and Toby had brought Gordon to the steamworks to see Victor. Gordon was acting very strange, and Victor had checked him all over to find the problem. Hmm, it's just as I thought. What? Gordon is in love. <gasps> Gordon? In love? With who? With some purple and gray streamliner. What? Oh no, it's that new engine Caitlin. Gordon must have the same attitude I had ever since Molly came to the island. <sighs> it's true. I'm in love with Caitlin, man. She's so beautiful. She must be the fairest engine of them all. Gordon, honestly, being beautiful isn't everything to any of us. But being responsible, reliable, and really useful is a single thing. But Caitlyn looks beautiful. Her shape, her colors, they're beautiful. Caitlyn is a streamlined engine, Gordon! Like Connor, both he and Caitlyn are the fastest engines from the mainland. Can you by any chance add some streamline to me, Victor? Why do you want me to do that? You're a great engine, Gordon, just the way you are. That night, Gordon felt just the same feeling. The other engines didn't know how to make him snap out of it. Oh, you want to deliver the mail with me, Gordon? I could use the help I can get. No thanks, Percy. I know. You can take my local train tomorrow. I can take the express for you if you want. <laughs> I don't know, James. You're not that strong enough to pull the express for Gordon. Maybe not, but I can be fast enough to get the passengers from station to station. The next morning, Gordon had to take the 8.30 express service from Natford to Marin. He was just approaching Wellsworth Station when the Station Master flagged him down. Caitlin is stuck on Gordon's Hill. She can't get over it with her coaches. Please, go and see what the problem is. Gordon can see that Caitlin was at the bottom of the hill, looking sad. Her driver tried to cheer her up. Come on, Caitlin. It's not really a bad thing. Oh, but it is a bad thing. We were going so nicely until I was held back. Why wasn't I checked before I made it happen? Gordon's driver came up. What's happened? Caitlin has burst her safety valve. She can't pull the train anymore. We have to get these passengers to Abbey Station. We can help you, but we have to make a quick stop at Marin Station first. Gordon is on the A3 Express service. Oh, thank you. That would be much appreciated. Soon, Gordon was coupled up to the back of Caitlin's train. And helping Caitlin up and over Gordon's Hill, they all headed for both Marin and Abbey Station.
last they reached Abbey Station. Here we are! The passengers cheered and thanked both Caitlin and Gordon. But Gordon was exhausted for working very hard, pushing Caitlin and the train along the main line. Thank you for helping me, Gordon. You were, you were really amazing. What a strong engine you are. Gordon liked everyone to know how strong he is. He also liked to help his friends. He helped Caitlin with the passengers, and now he has to help her again. Shall I take you to the Steamworks to have your safety valve fix? Oh, thank you, Gordon. That would be nice. And that's what Gordon did. He brought Caitlin to the Steamworks so that her safety valve can be repaired. Although the question that Gordon didn't ask her was a surprise. But I mustn't tell you what it is, or I shall spoil the next story. <laughs>